Empire again. Uh, I did decide to stream some Dominions, and I like to just run my mouth for the first four and a half minutes. If you watch this on YouTube, you can just jump to four and a half minutes to get into the actual streaming type part. I check my settings and do all that shit during this period. I cannot uh, stream uh, Dominions with with sound because otherwise it um, I get like a demonetization strike, which makes me laugh that it's Dominions of all games that would uh, cause that, and so I can't do that. Also, I, in my description, I was gonna say you know it says like your go live notice. It's like. Lord Haywire is a sacrificing fool is what I wanted to put on there, but it wouldn't let me. It said that's a, f well, it didn't tell me which word, but I figured out that was fool. F I couldn't put fool in the description, uh, which is kind of fun. Why fool is the one, the word that, that upsets him. Th this has happened before in the past, by the way. It's, it didn't like shill. It didn't like the word shill, and it didn't like, um, there was another one. I can't remember what it was, but chill definitely it wouldn't let me do, and now it won't let me do fool. I am going to create a new game. I wanted to look at something though here. All right, so this one's called Twitch. I wish I could rename it. Can I click on it and rename it? No. Um, I'm gonna do a new game as Mitch Lynn. Oh, I got this. What is that on my shoulder? Which shoulder is that? That's my left shoulder. Wasn't there a minute ago. Fuck is behind me. Alright, I think it's this pillow. One second. Alright. Um... The ad's almost done. How much time? So this time it's only two minutes. Two and a half minutes. Oh. Yeah, the ad is done. Weird. Well, I guess I lied to everybody. Don't jump to four and a half. I don't know. I've been trying to... Uh, um, give people, if they watch it on YouTube, a place to skip to. Because a lot of times I just fuck around, you know, set up my stream. And, you know, when streaming, no one joins the stream the minute you start, so. Um, I'm going to call this Twitch. So it's not like the people, if they're watching the stream, are missing anything. We're going to do early age. Um, but YouTube, you know, it's like you got to sit through all this shit. Anyways, I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Let's see if I can hold this up here. Nope. <laughs> this makes everything go away. Uh, I dug my Dominions 3 manual out, and I've been reading it while I take a shit. It's, like, perfect. You can read one about one nation um, in the time it takes to sh take a shit. And I was like, man, I kind of want to play some blood sacrifice people. So uh, that's what I'm going to do. The Michelin. I also like Quetzalcoatl. Like the concept of Quetzalcoatl, a bunch, and that would allow me to. Um, whoops, I want to be a human here. To uh, maybe get him. Maybe I can play as Quetzalcoatl. These are like kind of they're they're kind of sort of based on like Aztec and Mayan stuff. Oh, I should probably read this. I haven't read this. What does it say in this one? If it's different, oh. Uh, Michelin is an old kingdom ruled by priest kings. Their god hungers and must be slated with blood sacrifice. Yes. Uh, Michelin has powerful blood mages and priests, but its infantry uses archaic weaponry. Its infantry sucks. Uh, we're going to go okay to that. Michelin is an ancient tribal empire that has been isolated for centuries. The foul practice of the priest kings of Michelin have caused most of their neighbors to, to leave or face slavery and blood sacrifice. Oh, wait, these guys aren't as bad as I remember. Um, 
since the dawn of the kingdom, blood has been spilled in the temples of the capital to feed the waning powers of the hungry god. The armies are mainly composed of slaves from newly conquered lands. The mage priests of Michelin celebrate the two faces and the two dominions of the hungry god, namely, namely the sun and moon and the rain and the forest. They are all skilled blood mages. That's pretty much the same description as Dominions 3. In fact, it might be identical. Where humans, we prefer, prefer heat scale 1. All right. Um... Light infantry with slings and javelins. Tribal kings can levy slaves. I don't know what that means, but we'll figure it out. Sacred jaguar and uh, eagle warriors. Blood, fire, astral, nature, water. Mages, priests, powerful can perform blood sacrifice. Domain does not spread unless blood is sacrificed. What? Okay. Bless bonus. Fire bless points plus one. Blood bless point. I don't know what that means. Uh, permanent fortified. So then we got some dudes, scouts, tribal kings. He's a slaver. And some other game, I was like, I'll never play a slaver. Here I am, Dominions. <clears throat> slaver is great. Dominions. One of my random options here. 10%. Oh, I think, aren't these guys like old? Oh, wait, they have age on here now. No. Oh. What is this guy? A shape changer into a turkey. Uh, the Nahali are Michelin sorcerers. They have little influence in society and live secluded lives in rural areas. Oh my god, I'm losing network frame rates again. Some weird shit's been happening in my house. I have like a thousand up and down and past couple days I've been having network issues with streaming. Well, past two days. Earlier today it didn't happen. It just happened now. I feel like I'm getting throttled or something. Uh, they have little influence in society and live secluded lives in rural areas. They are beast mage and shaman, able to bind animals to the surface by entering the spirit world. And the holly are also able to shape change into their, atom in their animal spirit double. Which is a turkey? Hmm, that doesn't seem that great. Uh, I have never played these guys, or if I have, it was years ago. So, I'm kind of going to check everybody's shit here. I'm doing it. Um, I'm going to do it regardless. I might die. What does this do? This command commander can levy slave warriors. What does Taskmaster do again? Did I, um... Click done on this? Hope I did. You gotta click done to tell him that you're... You're, uh... You update your shit. Uh, Priest King and High Priest of the Sun. Oh, this guy's old. 50 and he's 54 and he's old? Man, I'm 48! 46 is old age? Jesus Christ. <clears throat> wow. Uh, then we got warriors. I don't think there's anything special about these guys. What does this do again for survival? Alright, so they move through forest. Warrior. Warrior. Uh, we already know. Warriors. So they got stone shit. So it's weird that they put stone. They don't put like uh, um, obsidian weapons because those are... Oh, this is early age, too, by the way. Uh, obsidian. Oh, this guy's got an obsidian club. So, supposedly, according to historical records, they watched uh, the Spanish or somebody charge some uh, Aztec warriors, and one of them chopped a horse's head off with his obsidian sword. And they were shocked. So, they're like obsidian. They're obsidian swords that you see in the pictures. Like, if you live in San Diego or probably any place that's close to the border. I mean, obviously, even Mexico, but San Diego is like, every Mexican restaurant you go to has like some velvet paintings. Like Quetzalcoatl is often in there, but uh, a lot of the Aztec warriors have like the swords in the, in, the, in the paintings. They're like wood with the obsidian attached on the sides. Um, so the obsidian part's fragile, but it's also sharper than a... a uh, 
sharper than a scalpel. It's the sharpest thing, so you'd expect it to do some massive damage. All right, so all my guys are pretty standard. Whoa, what is this guy, though? He's just a... Hey, Power, how are you? Yeah, it's volcanic glass, so it's extremely... When it breaks off... I actually have some in the other room. Um, I did some anthropology classes and got to flint nap, as it's called. And you're actually not supposed to go collect obsidian. <laughs> you're not supposed to just go... Because it... uh is a limited resource. It doesn't come back. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, it doesn't... It's not like a tree. There's a limited amount of it. I guess there, it does come back to a point because it is volcanic, but... Um, so I'm also going to play this... I think I'm going to... Well, let's pick... What is this What is this little guy? Like a lich or something? A demi-lich. I, I think I'm going to thug out my leader this time, too. You know what? Also, it didn't ask me... It didn't ask me how I wanted to play the game yet. I think I might do the Ascension Thrones as well. But this I think I'm going to do an Awake guy, which I never do. And I think I'm going to thug him out. Look at this fucking person. To Tio Inan. What? <laughs> I wanted some information. Uh, blood Searcher. Unsurroundable. Has 2d6 horn serpents at her side at the start of each battle. It looks like she's bleeding blood out of her multiple four nipples. She has two snake heads. This is uh, the Tetio and Nan. How is your night going, anyways, Power? Yeah, I don't. I've never. Pl I never play a thug god, so I'm. I don't know. Should I keep my... Should I make sure they have regeneration? Let me look. I keep selecting instead of... I want to... Look at this guy. God damn it. No! Cancel. Um... Oh, right. The permanent wounds. I mean, think about that. See, that's why I always need chat in, in here to help me with Dominions. Even when they die? Uh, what is the symbol for regeneration? I think it's something like that. Swimming, though. This person has frogs with them. And toads. Let's see what our options are here. Stealthy reanimate bonus, huh? Skelly spam. None of these guys have regeneration. What about like, who's this guy? Bolantiku. An amphibian. He comes with skeletons. The undead. Look at this guy. Serpent. It's got a... <laughs> it's got the head of a... <laughs> a deer. Body of a snake. Could just be some badass tiger? This, uh... This guy... This one. No, this is recuperation. Unit heals its afflictions over time. There once he gets old, what when does it, what's old age set in for this guy? Five thousand? And there's twelve. So I just gotta get done before like thirty six thousand turn or something. <laughs> okay, so it's this thing. What's the name of that? Kada Kadekus? Uh, Dick, I never heard. Is this the, is that the healing like the international? No, the the word you used. God, I'm gonna copy and paste it for the symbol. It's the symbol of Hermes. 
and features two snakes. It's the symbol of medicine. I didn't know that that's what this was, what this symbol was. <laughs> this only has one snake. Does that make it bigger? How do you say this word? Well, let will it tell me? Um, oh, you guys wouldn't be able to hear it anyways. Learn uh, even even stuff non Dominions related. I learned from playing Dominions. Thank you, Power, for pointing out that new word. What about a dragon? What is this thing? A dragon master. <clears throat> Quetzalcoatl is not on here. Vulnerable to salt. All right, I don't want to be any of these guys. These guys, I'm always those guys. Uh, what does it mean by these different dominion levels? If I put this higher, does it give me different choices? Whoops. No. Oh, that's what they cost. No, I don't know what that is. I've played this lady a bunch of times. The Great Mother. All right, I don't, so that for recuperation, what is this one again? Oh, it's swimming. What is that? Is that like a little lizard swimming or something? Whoops. Yeah, I usually ignore that part, that sacred unit thing. It did say these guys, and I, I'm not sure how that works. Can I go back to here? This part, what does this part mean? Bonus bless, fire bless points plus one and bless, blood bless points. Does that, they automatically get that? Oh, he's got, see, he's got the, obsidian sword like I was talking about so the only that one who was it it was this guy oh wait is this this is just a phoenix a demon macaw <laughs> what <laughs> uh, there's got to be a magic item that gives you recuperation too How much do these guys cost? They're pretty expensive. I kind of want to be this crazy lady. She gets 2d6 horned serpents at the, her side at the beginning of... Hmm. Her snake skirt. Her skirt is made out of snakes. Uh, Medusa needs one of those. She causes fear. She's a supply bonus. She's not very good at spells. This guy has frogs with for five nature. I wasn't planning to blast nature though. Hmm. The initial God setup sometimes takes me hours. I'm trying not to do that. And actually, so generally what I do instead is I just go, you know what I mean? I always pick one of these suckers down here because I know them, but I kind of don't want to do that this time. Um, I want to pick something new. I want to try new stuff, you know? Get out of, and they, they it defaulted to this guy. What does this do? Um, three months to reform and the process will get rid of most affliction. Immortality does not work on other planes. So a nice little caveat there. All right. Do I want to be a dragon? No, let's be one of these. All right. Let's say we're going to be definitely be one of these guys. Let's narrow it down. Let's look at this guy. He comes with some Jaguars and Teetle combat caster. Um, a combat caster's 50% chance of trying to cast a spell in melee, and the chance of being interrupted by damage is halved. Uh, he's a divine giant of divine heritage with the deception of Titio Eon and her, 
in her plot against the Panto Creator, which is the like that person died, and that's why Dominions is happening. Um, the Pan Creator answered by impregnating the Mother of Gods with a ball of feathers. When she gave birth, the t t t the title. <laughs> God, it's so bad at pronouncing pronouncing stuff. Uh, was born fully aware and armed with serpents stole from his mother's womb. I don't know. Uh, Serpent Club. What do you think, Power? I still like her. She's got the blood searcher thing. She's got fear. How many hit points has she got? 88. She's size 6. She comes with a bunch of lizards. Or snakes, I mean. This guy looks kind of cool, too. But he's an undead dude. What does he come with? 1d6 beast bats and 3d6 long dead. <clears throat> Fortune teller... What was this guy's thing again? Besides the long dead, he's an amphibian because he's undead. He's sneaky. Spirit sight. Units with spirit sight gain no get no penalties from darkness and can see invisible units. That's pretty rare. Poison resistant. He's undead though. He does have um, bat wings. The Hoon came, one dead, is a giant of divine heritage, once placed in charge at the beginning of the cycle of death by the previous uh, Panto creator. He would cause death and lamentation. You know what? No, let's stick with the blood thing. Let's check one of these guys. Yeah, he's the same. So one, this one, let's do her. Um, what does it say about her, though, at the end? She with the snake skirts uh, has returned to creation to claim it as her own. She wears a horrible necklace made of skulls, hands, and hearts of men. Once beautiful, she is... Well, she doesn't even have a head, man. I mean, she's got two snakes as a head. Of course she's a whore to, to um, behold. Oh, I was like, what is going on here? Uh, get that out of here. I think, what well, we, because I'm going to make her awake, which is unusual for me, too. Okay, so that's what this, that Dominion 3 thing means. It means that she's got to um, start at Dominion 3, so she can't appear. I never do awake people. I always do in prison, but I'm going to do an awake person. <sighs> New paths cost 60. That costs, what, like... How do you do math? It's like seven or something, eight? Oh, she does have nature. What does it cost to get her up to nature five? Whoa. Huh, that, that isn't that bad. So she's sacred though? I guess the God has to be sacred. That isn't bad, that isn't a bad succession. Let's, let's also bump her Oh, I should probably do something down here. It's like 40 points to do that. So I'm going to be gathering slaves, and I'm going to be... Maybe I should just start out with, like, nothing on here. I've never done that either. I always pump my dominion up. Uh, I don't know if it was... No, I think it was somebody else uh, was talking about Hell Blessing, where you, you make this really terrible to get points. I don't think I want to do that. Let's see here. We could actually bump... Okay, so that get, that's the bonus it was talking about. So I can get level... Unholy Weapons. Incarnation only. All right. Unit, the blessed units will be able to withstand more damage before they die, plus one hit points. Blood Vengeance. Blessed units will get the Blood Vengeance trait. If the unit, blessed unit is wounded, the attacker must roll MR. I think that's magic resistors. Or get an equal amount of damage. 
unholy weapons. Attack from the blessed units will strike with additional unholy damage. That can only damage that can only damage false pretenders and their sacred troops. This will affect all weapons except natural ranged attacks such as mind blast. Wait, what does this do? All weapons that can only damage false pretenders and so this is will it hurt their um sacred troops basically blessed units will transfer half of, half of all incoming damage to other blessed friendly units that are nearby that's a weird one but it could it, if they're getting their ass kicked it could spread the damage so you survive longer Blessed units will receive a blood surge as soon as they kill someone. The blood surge will effect will last a few rounds and greatly increase the combat abilities of the units. Blood surge will not take effect when killing an inanimate user. Strength of flesh, increased strength, one extra hit point. What was this? Let me view this description again. Fire. <coughs> and blood oh but i don't have any fire bloody nature is like a pangea thing almost uh how many points do i what does it cost to get one of these up so if i do this i can't even get any of these up i could make it worse so, oh, and that's the level five. What do we get out of this? Can't do that. Whoops, what am I doing here? Leave me five design points. I hate having extras. It is, it's, it's 60 points. Oh, you mean after they even have one? Yeah. Well, that's like, what, eight? Yeah, it's eight. This is like 60. I mean, she is a blood god, and I'm seven points into that thing. I can't get this. That that one actually, I guess I could try. I could get, but recuperation though does sound good. What happens if I like customs priest spell? What are these? Banish. Uh, we'll see these banishments. Smite. Well, I don't know. Ward of Thorns. I remember that one is, but I don't remember what Final Rest is. Claim Life. I don't remember that one is either. What is this? This is six. Five. I kind of like this one, so let's do this. We have two points left. I could do then just do that one. And I could even get rid of one of those points. But none of these other ones are going to give me what I want. 37 isn't enough to go up here. Well, I mean, having an extra one is in the end of the world. Or can I put that in there twice? I can put that in there twice? I didn't know that. <clears throat> I think this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to lose five points, but that's not bad. That's not bad for Dominion. Sometimes you get kind of screw yourself. All right, this is going to be difficult, especially for how shitty I am at this game. All right, okay. Quat, Quatalik? What was her name? Quatalik? I'm not. Um, let's call her um, Reptile Brain. Reptile. I can't spell my way out of a rep. Uh, of a reptile brain. I have a rep. I have a wet paper bag. So 
I gotta uh, double check. All right, reptile brain. All praise reptile brain strength one. Special sight frequency. Let's bump this up. I never do this either. Seventy five. Yeah. Money multiplier resources. Uh, let's make them common. Enabled, enabled, 15, 5. Let's go to like 10 or something crazy. 9, limited, normal. St I'm going to do standard research this time too, which I almost always do very hard. Uh, difficult, very difficult. Yeah, I'm going to do standard. It's, I'm going to play this way different than I normally do. Uh, random start, sure. Well, let's see, Thrones of Ascension. This is the thing I never do, ever. What is this cataclysm? After a certain number of turns, a worldwide clouds cataclysm event will occur that forces a pretender to ascend in a few months' time. And only this will only limit the maximum. Nah, we don't want that. <coughs> uh, victory by throne of ascension. Ascension points required seven. If I bump this up to 15. Oh, there we go. Uh, we have zero level three. Uh, the province of level three is guarded by a huge infinite and will yield three ascension points and a powerful bonus of, uh, affects the printer who claims it. Claiming a threat requires a pretender, discipline, or a level three, or disciple, or a level three priest. <clears throat> uh, so there's seven level one, and there's four level two, and that doesn't add up to 15. That adds up to 14. No, that adds up to 15. Yes. <laughs> Let's put one of these guys in here. Let's put two of these guys in here. Let's put three of these guys in here. Let's make this really crazy. Six and nine. And to win, we'll need, well, let's say, 25. Let's do 28. Usually how it ends is I, you can just tell you're going to win or lose. I, and I am going to go back, back to my Pangea game. I just was getting bored of it. And I started reading, like I said, I started reading the, man, the uh, Dominion 3 manual. And I was like, man, I want to play a blood person. All right, this is going to be intense with this level 3 thing. Level 2. All right. Um, and I never do thrones and passwords. Renaming is allowed. Cheat prevention. Looks good. I wonder, can I force an ad right now and go smoke? I can. Whoops. <laughs> I'll be right back. Right. Is this going to work? Right now, I'll be back in less than five minutes.
this usually can take quite a while, which is why I figured do a break now and uh, play an ad now because they force me to play an ad every uh, hour. Though it looks like because I played an ad early, they didn't that didn't work. Um, so they force me to play an ad every an hour. They play it regardless. I can snooze ads. Um, oh, it says an hour and 25 minutes. So maybe that 30 second ad push gave me an extra 25 minutes. But anyways, yeah, I got to play an ad because like I was saying earlier, uh, Twitch needs, needs the money, right? They take half of the subscriber thing. They need the extra 10 cents they make off ads for me. Um, so I try to schedule my breaks, take the ads so that anybody in chat can go take a break at the same time, come back, and I figure with Dominions during setup where we just watch the world be created for uh, 10 minutes or whatever it takes. Oh, I should pull my stats back up. And Dominions is also, if you're wondering, I know I mentioned this before, but if you're wondering why there's no music for Dominions or no sound or music playing, they get a, I get a monetization thing from YouTube strike against me if I have music from Dominions. They, it's the weirdest thing. Dominions and Distant World Universe 2, both two like indie games that no one ever plays. Uh, whoever the musicians are, I'd be fine. I'd be fine with splitting the money. I don't make any money off that either. <laughs> I'm not really about the making the money, but it, I feel like it's unfair if they're making money off of me, if that makes sense. Um, there's a fine line. This is an enormous world. This is the largest, so this is going to take a while. I, I saw someone else streaming, and his world looked like a Dominions 2 or three world map. I'm wondering if people just pick Dominions 5 when they're playing Domin an earlier version of Dominions. Um, I would say, so, okay, so while we're waiting for this, they're actually in this manual, they have a strategy for the different um, uh, nations. And so for this one, early Michelin, it says, tried in imprisoned fountain of blood with Dominion 7 and scales of order 3, sloth 3, death 3, Mis misfortune 3, heat 2, and magic 1. For magic, magic paths, take fire 9, water 9, and blood 6. On first turn, make your tribal king your prophet and recruit a priest and some sacred units. Blood hunt with your prophet, and on subsequent turns, keep recruiting priest kings and sacred units. Use your profit and 14 sacred units to start expanding on turn 3. Recruit independent commanders and in newly gained provinces. So yeah, I'm going to have to do the independent commanders like mad, I have a feeling. Rush with your research to blood 4. Once you get there, use your priest king to capture uh, Michelin slaves, not blood slaves, for a few turns. Keep recruiting priest kings as well as high priests of the sun. The former to blood hunt and the later to summon jaguar fiends. When you have 40 or 50 jaguar fiends, rush an opponent. Start researching construction four for sanguine dowsering rods. Then complete. Uh, then continue with blood for unique summons. Around turn 20, you can have 50 jaguar fiends at least. It will be tough for your opponents to resist them. Later, conjuration becomes important for mound fiends who can lead and bless lots of jaguar fiends and blood bats. If you find independent air mages, you can even forge air boots for them and drown the world in hordes of summoned beasts. Uh, this strategy is also appropriate for late-aged Michelin. I don't think I'm going to do anything this strategy says except for recruit independent things. No, I'll probably rush my research to blood for... Or just blood. I never use blood. I always research it just like a little bit on the way, but... We have normal research set, so it should be pretty quick compared to what I'm I'm used to the, the um, very difficult version. And we're almost done here, I think. I thought about doing mid middle age because I have middle age here too. 
I mean, this this manual is how many pages is this fucking manual? This is for Dominion's 3D though. Um, 290 pages. It came back in the good old days when you bought like CDs and stuff. It came with the CD. It probably cost more to print the manual than it did to for the um, to create the CD and whatnot. In fact, I know it did. Wonder if can you guys see that thing flapping around? Yeah, every time I go, oh, here we go, here we go. <laughs> Uh, in the beginning, there's chaos. Now the wheel has turned once again. Oh, I'm at the edge of the map. That's an interesting starting place. Got a lot of caves. There's a thing. Here's one, too. Throne of Ascension. Here's another one. Here's another one. Interesting. All right, here we go. Oh, here she is, Reptile Brain. I'm, I was like, who the fuck is that? And, but I already, I started her out with, um, all right, we got Blood Bond as well. And we got Recuperation. And her hit points are 99. Yeah, we're just going to have her go out smashing shit. Well, uh, hopefully she'll smash shit. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, in K uh, produces three blood slaves a turn and two fire gems. That's pretty good. Uh, astral gems, water gems, and nature. Eagle warrior. I suck with flying, guys. I'm kind of curious. They're sacred. How that's going to work. Uh, laboratory temple, all that standard jazz. Oh, I'm digging my, my flag and stuff here. A lot of times I'll wait one turn before I go out so I can know what's around me, but I don't even think I'm going to do that this time. I'm going to go crazy. Oh, I am going to... Like, what? what is this guy's... What is his slave thing? Capture slaves. Capture and, slaves tr uh, and train slaves to use in the army. Wonder, I probably don't want to do that in my home base, though. Or do I? <clears throat> what is Reptile Brain's leadership like? 120. So she's got, she's good with that. These guys suck. <laughs> I fought these guys a bunch, and they've all died. In droves. They have slings, though. Those guys do. Are they both? They all have slings. Range of 30. 30. What's their precision? 10. I think 10 is bad. I think, like, 20 is good. Uh, these guys got better armor, though, right? Leather cap, shield, and Michelin armor. Yeah. We're going straight. Oh, they're getting a bonus to morale. What is their morale? A 14 isn't bad, actually. So they would have a 12 normally. We're going to have these guys. Uh, yeah, 10 is, 10 is about... 10 is bad, actually. I feel like 10 is bad for morale. I mean, it might be normal, but I still feel like it's bad. Uh, we're going to have fire closest. Fire and keep distance. No, we're just going to have fire closest. And we're going to have you attack. We're going to put you right up front. Something I never do. Good God. Uh, we're going to have you attack. Whoops. <laughs> uh, I don't play humans that much actually Olm I've played a couple of times and they're surprisingly I think they they I don't know what their morale is I think their protection and stuff sucks um, what spells can you cast here blood burst Uh, 
Um, it doesn't look like she can do that. That's I normally have uh, my um, what you call it, my prophet. A lot of times I'll spam him to do bless, and uh, there's another one, smite and bless. It look like she has the ability to bless. She's, she's figures she's the god. Uh, let's see here. She doesn't have any of these gems, so I guess for the, the first turn, I'm just going to have her attack closest. Put her at the front. Let's put these guys at the front. And these guys right here. I double line without too much pain. Perfect. We're going to have you, Tribal King. And what is this guy? A scout. We're going to have you become prophet. Well, let me look. Let me see. I don't know these these leaders that much. What is your deal? You're just a leader. A slave dude. Oh, you're sacred. Already. How much cash do I got here? 400? I think everyone starts out with 400. Man, almost everybody. In fact, I think, I didn't even look at this. I think everybody is, wow, they are. Like, everybody's a priest. Huh. I got to change this music. It's like some um, punk rock mix. And I, I like punk rock music, but the mix sometimes is mixes. Uh, can be pretty bad. I guess I'm picky about it. Yeah, some of them can be. I don't know where they got that. You know, whatever. There's a there's a wide variety of punk, and it, try to do like a mix sometimes doesn't work. It was just some random thing YouTube gave me. Um. It says I'm go I wasn't at 60 frame rates. Playing Dominions. I don't know. There's something wrong with my computer. Anyways. Uh, I think I want a researcher to pop out first. I don't want an old guy. I'm an ageist. I'm ageist. And so that guy's got blood and nature. Let's do this blood and nature guy probably. Yeah. And we got water on that guy. 2.30. So what was it talking about Jaguar summoning things? Let's look at... That is a different version. Now, summon Jaguar Toads. Nature Gems. That's a level 1 thing. Oh, and they're... Uh, oh, no, level 1 is required, but that doesn't matter. All my, all my guys are... Oh, so this is... I got all sorts of summoning shit. Contact Quaddle. Yeah, why don't they call him Quetzalcoatl? He's not to the Quetzalcoatl part. Um, oh, A Quaddle. All right, Quetzalcoatl must be his name. One of the four powerful rain... Wow, they got a lot of these are special. So in Dominions, the ones that are blue are only this this group gets. So I'm not gonna do that yet here. What did we get? Blood magic, bind beasts, bind jaguar fiends. This is what they were talking about in that help thing, or in the strategy guide for the third one. Contact civet. Jesus Christ. The mage priest sits at a crossroad after seven days. Wow, it takes a look at all the blood slaves. Holy shit. 
Okay. Um, I already started out with Blood 1? Alright. Uh, it was a random start. Yeah, I don't think I need any of this stuff right off the bat. I'm trying to pay... God damn it, I keep doing that. Pay more attention here. Construction. Oh, I started out with construction one. I kind of want to do conjuring just to be able to get this. It's a weird, weird. Great toads are found in the deep forest. So basically what I've learned from Chad is that I don't take advantage of the advantages I have. I just kind of make everyone the same, build a bunch of troops, attack a place, and... But man, I could go for bind beast bats, so I need to like pay more attention, you know? Uh, beast bat is a sacred bat fiend. It's summoned and bound by human sacrifice. Bowl of blood. Yeah, so that gives us more. And I made it so that there's more things. And I have like two blood in almost all my guys, or my guys that I'm recruiting. Uh, let's embrace the blood. Then let's do conjur conjuration. It's going to cost me a hundred though. All right, we'll do it this way. And let's go back to my recruiting. Let's make sure this is the blood guy. There's no random dudes. Uh, these guys are sacred. These guys are sacred. Sacred. Not sacred. All right. Let's get a banner. 170 gold. I'm so not used to it. I'm used to commanders taking multiple turns, too. It's going to be weird having commanders that don't take forever. All right, he's profiting out. You're going to here. I'm going to go to here. I mean, let's send you this direction. Let's send you this direction. And you're going to go in here. First turn. Ne something I never do. I'll probably lose all of my guys or, and my god. But I'm going to try to continue, even if that happens. You know, the stream will be over in like 15 minutes, but <laughs> we'll see. Uh, all right. Let's 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 think here. We don't have archers. We have javelins. All right. What about these, these guys? They're kind of expensive. 31 recruitment points. Fire resistant. All right, let's build some chumps first. I, I like an army full of chumps. We got the warriors, javelin, and mace. I actually like javelin guys. I prefer javelin guys over slingers any day of the week because they get that throw right before they hit. So let's fill some chumps up. No, let's do this. What is this guy? What's this guy special? Oh, he's got the obsidian club. But they're so expensive. All right. Build two of those guys. Man, all right, I set up my research, I read my messages, there's gonna be nothing on the Hall of Fame. Thrones of Ascension. Let's hope I didn't fuck that up, that set up. I guess that's it for my first turn. I feel like I'm completely forgetting about something, but I'm not. All right, let's see how it goes. Sending my god in first.
All right. So this is just proclamations. That they just this is just saying that they made made uh, profits. There is a battle in soaked earth. Uh, she died. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. All right. Let's view the battle. Even with her lizards. Look at this person's name. I wonder if her own guys... Oh, she died like immediately. She must have like no protection. Man. Maybe I should restart. I should have saved it before I did that. No. <laughs> oh, I, uh, so Sam, I normally never send my my god in right off like that, but I wanted to play it different, and I don't think I'm gonna restart. I'm just gonna man, just against a couple of those guys though, lizard men. Jesus Christ. It'll be hard to recover from that though. It takes so long to load a world. All right, let's do this. Let's call my god back. Let's pretend like I didn't just do that, and we'll we'll recover. We're gonna recover. It's gonna be a huge setback, but we're gonna recover. Um, I need to build another guy. They all have blood. Let's, oh, this is a blood three. Oh, except he's old. Let's do one of these guys. Can I get away with doing this? No, yes. Why does this guy look grayed out? Oh, he's a holy guy. That's why he's grayed out. Let's do that then. And then let's put some chumps back in here. We can recover. It's a learning experience. And we'll have that guy, then we'll have the prophet. Because all these guys are dead, I think. No, I guess they came back. He's short turn though. No research going on. She probably doesn't have any armor or something. I didn't even look at that. We'll see if I can recover. This might be, occasionally when I play multiplayer, we have to restart after like turn three because like, oh, I've talked about this before. Uh, what's the guy's name? The ogre. Um, bogus? Bogus will show up, like spawn on your capital and kill you or spawn right, right on top of you. All right, you're gonna call God. And you are my prophets, yes. You are going to um, you are going to lead this army to victory over here. At least you better. Oh, this is not who I was thinking this is. These guys I don't want to send out yet. These are the more... Ex no, these guys I do. These are the new... What is their morale? 12? Okay, let's let's set this up here. This person can cast Blessing. Alright. Bless. Do you have Smite? Do you have no? Sermon of Courage? Yes. And then you can just cast spells after that. And we're going to put you not in the front like I did. Not like that. This guy I was using as slingers. Double line. These guys are good. Well, good is subjective. Attack closest. Let's 
Oh, I want to double line these guys too. And these guys are bad. They're not bad. They're no, they're bad. I'm gonna double line these guys. Okay. This is our brilliant plan here. We're gonna retake that. And we're gonna leave my sacred guys. Yes, I didn't accidentally give it like a sacred guy in here, did I? And now you're going back there. Call God, 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 recruits. I want one of these guys now. You got water and a stone dagger. You're on repeat with those guys. Guess that's it. <clears throat> I should have known better. I never send my own god. I usually just have him sit in the capital. And a lot of times I'll pay, play one an immobile god, but I wanted to mix stuff up. Playing a, a group that I don't know anything about. All right. We only lost two warriors. What happened to my other guys that were... It didn't list the other guys. That's weird. Did they not get into the cut or something? They're there. Oh, he didn't cast uh, Bless. Oh, I forgot to change his name. Look at that. That's all they had left. Oh, and they're running away. All right. Enough of that. These travel guys suck, too. Like, yeah, their, their whole army was defeated. <laughs> their whole army was defeated, but not before they killed my god. All right, you're back in action here, sir. Not, you're new. Now, what are, you, what are you? You're cheaper. You're just cheaper priest, but you don't. Oh, you have a chance of getting death or something. What does this thing do? Oh, spirit sight. Oh, this is the turkey guy. I'm gonna make a turkey guy because I want him to turn into a turkey, and he can call the god as well. Oh, is that is that what's going on? Um. Oh. Warrior, and then. Yep. Yep. That would be a bug. I have never seen a bug in Dominions. I was talking about this in another stream, and I actually saw that the. They did an update recently that was just like, it had some bug fixes and stuff, and I've never seen a bug in Dominions. Um, and so, someone else in, in chat was saying that uh, they had occasionally ran into a very minor bug, um, but I've never actually seen one. All right, what do we got here? All right, we got some lizards. What is this swimming thing? Seems like it's new. What does this even do? Oh, rivers on the main map. And what about you? Supply bonus isn't bad. You're sacred. And you're a researcher. Interesting. Uh, what do I need here? Lab and a temple. Double check that I'm recruiting stuff here. Yes, I'm going to recruit. Normally, I also almost never recruit shit on the, the neutral areas. They're not neutral. The independent areas. But I think that is going to be a requirement here. All right, I definitely think I can take these guys. Lion tribe warriors suck. Or at least I think they do. Maybe they kind of not, not, <laughs> not against my, <laughs> my, my guys. Um, monkeys. I can take some monkeys. Now, I'm going to keep moving forward. I guess I could 
Hmm. Capture slaves. I've never used that in ever in any Dominions game. What does it do? Let's find out. I mean, I know it gets gets me slaves from my army, but does it does it decimate their population? Whoa. I guess I can't take a screenshot of Dominions. Let's try that again. Sometimes I can trick it. I can trick it. I want to see what this province thing is here. Whoops. All right. Uh, yeah, let's capture some slaves and see what that brings me in here. And we got your call on the god back. She's going to be minus one level of blood or something. But maybe I can empower her or something later. Probably not send her in straight away. We don't have anybody researching. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> All right, more uh, pluck, pl <laughs> whatever. More, oh, it's these guys. These guys are trash. Oh, they have a 10 morale. All right, let's see what happened though to, yeah, so I lost 20 population. What else did I lose? Got a pop on my screen, screenshot here. I can't remember anything, so I just have to take a screenshot of everything. Um, supply, income went down a tiny bit, unrest went up, yeah. I don't know. What the, we'll we'll only use that in a in emergency there. Let's put a couple of points into defense while I'm here. Can I force this guy to turn into a turkey? He really is a turkey. Does he have different abilities as a turkey? This turkey is a large, tasty hen. Some Nahali sorcerers shape change into turkeys. <laughs> why? <laughs> this is actually one of the reasons why I like Dominions is because of stuff like that. It's probably, you know, there's probably like some uh, Mayan or Aztec thing where there's guys turning turkeys and they're like, you know, sacred beings or something. Um... And so they just say, I'm actually going to keep him as a turkey. It seems like he can still call God, or he's not a, he can research as a turkey. His research didn't change. 13. He can't, oh, he can fly now as a turkey. Mesmerize? What does it do? What does mesmerize do? It's just mag magical damage? <clears throat> All right, we got those guys going. We're going to go back. I don't think there's anyone else. Mm. He's old, though. I don't want an old guy. We're going to go back down the list here. I don't have the cash for that guy. Cash is going to become an issue, I see here. All right, let's go into here. I used to play Dominions too with my, one of my friends, and uh, what's your morale like? Thirteen. That's good. What do you do? You just stab stuff, right? Let's put him in with these guys, uh, and he would always just go for the easiest fight, and he would always have this this empire that was just one big long line <laughs> all the way. And it would always be the end of him. And we'd always be telling him, we would tell him, don't do that, man. You're, you're going to get, you're going to uh, get cut off. And then that's going to be the end of your thing. But he would still, he just, easiest attack was the way he would go. All right, let's move this guy here. I'm just kind of scouting around with the scout there. Uh, research, we didn't, <laughs> we just finally got a researching turkey. Um calling god in turn my turn, turn should be really fast but it never played this nation well i probably did at some point but 
not very long. Uh, unexpected events, and it's this happened after the battle, so that means we won. All right, we got a few gems, and we lost three slaves and five warriors. But who knows which type? Man, that's like kind of a bummer. Do they have like a GitHub or something where I can report this, or will they just say that's what we wanted to do? I don't know how well these guys fight, so I like to watch. You know, compare them. Because I know these guys, uh, these dudes suck. Okay, so my guys are just barely above those. And these archers actually took their toll. Hey, Chris, how are you? Long time no talk. Alright, we got this. So the other thing I'm telling myself to do this time is... To actually like summon stuff and use the the things I already have. Normally I just build troops and um Oh shit, I gotta do a blood sacrifice for that? I forgot. Only one bl blood sacrifice can be performed. Well let's get my god back. That should be the priority. What spells can you cast? You can't cash shit what about so I don't know if I've mentioned this before I had to stop drinking coffee and I looked because I just get I get all shaky and I happened to be looking at Google Maps and it said that the last time I went to the coffee shop was four years ago it made me sad because I love coffee. I used to just drink coffee all day long, but not anymore. All right, so I need to somehow spread my dominion, but if I I got to use my slaves though. What am I what am I researching here? Conjuration 1. Yes, that is now makes makes me feel like a better option. Uh it is they have jaguar warriors and their blood their blood guys. And I decided to um, start with my uh, god attacking immediately, and she died. <laughs> First turn. So we're trying to get her back here. Uh, yeah, first turn, death of the god. All right, uh, my treasury is, is really suffering here. I do want to summon another guy, though, regardless. We'll turn off that. Now. Now we'll keep that. We won't summon, or we won't buy a person this turn. I do need another commander to run troops, though. How much does this guy cost? 90 gold seems expensive, but we'll keep that. We'll bump up our defense a tiny bit again. You know, I could always do the slave thing to get more troops. Because these guys do not pack a punch, and I'm, I don't even think they could take these 30 dudes. From heavy infantry? I don't think so. What else could he do besides pick up slaves? He can call God. Let's capture slaves. We gotta get our army up, man. And we can pick up more guys here. He can search, I guess, but all he searches is level 3 sacred. I thought you didn't play uh, Dominions, Chris. I guess... Four or five slaves is better than no slaves. <clears throat> oh, someone got a uh, 
a Throne of Ascension, which I never play with that either, so. Yeah, I don't think we can take this. Oh, we could go over here. We probably could take these guys, but once again, it's the thing I was just telling my, talking about how my idiot friend used to do. Hmm. I've never played a blood uh, group correctly. Oh, these guys, are, oh, I put these in the wrong group. Um, I want these guys to go there. What do they got? They just got like, yeah, stone spear. Hmm, can we take these monkeys? Probably not. Uh, is Lucid like a YouTuber, YouTuber or something? Call God. We want you to call God. Oh, you can't. Oh, you're the leader guy. All right. All of these are going here. Oh, did we talk about him the other day or was that someone else? We were talking about, I think him and, oh no, maybe we we're talking about uh DOS tactics. I think that's that guy's name. Because of, uh, because of whatchamacallit, distant worlds. I might need to check out that. Uh, how fast can this guy get over here? I might need to check out that guy, uh, the guide. I'm gonna actually capture slaves here. Or how far away do we think we're from the God calling here? I could slip a moon priest in here. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I don't know if that's the connection or if we were talking. I don't know. Um, what can we recruit here? These guys suck. But maybe I should buy them. I only got five gold now. Let's put like one point. Man, I usually like to pump up my defense, but it looks like. Dead broke at 10. Man, I, I am going to have to do like that. My friend I was talking about. Just doing the big line out till I die. Let's go... Oh, you can't cross this river? Is that what the issue is? That is what the issue is. Uh, early age. I So I I pulled out my Dominions 3 manual, and I've been reading it while I sit on the toilet, and it made me want to play these guys. And I still have my other game. I haven't stopped playing the other game. I just wanted to, you know get in an, a little bit of different action here and you know what i'm gonna do let's check what these guys can summon yeah it's just imps right now i thought i had no fiery imps uh and I get burned out, I think I've mentioned this a thousand times, I get burned out on video games really quick. So, I like to like mix things up. And I wasn't really getting getting that burned out on the my Pangea game, but I just felt like I wanted to, like I couldn't decide tonight. But I was like, you know what, I wanna try a blood guy with like, like a completely different way of playing and obviously I'm failing already, but all right, he's still going to 
Call. We'll capture slaves one more time with him. Call. We should have a new guy here. Call God. The God's got to be coming soon. And then we can pump these guys into research. And I almost, I always do like really hard research, but this time I did normal. My friends actually, whenever I play multiplayer, they're always like, why do you want, why do you want to do extremely difficult research? And I always demand it. And they're like, it takes too long to get any good spells. So I thought I moved you. Oh, I did. You're just, yeah, cross this river. But every time I play, usually someone shows up in chat and tells me uh, a better way to play Dominions. Uh, hints, a, g a hint that's good. Actually, I, that happens every time I play any um, any video game. Which is why I put the, the thing, oh, we're already done with the Conjuration with this one guy researching? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, did I forget to pick up those guys? I think I forgot to pick up those guys because I'm an idiot. No, they're here. All right. This is an army that can fight now. Uh, what do we got here? What are these guys again? These guys have javelins. I want all my javelin guys to be in one group. The suckers go first. These are blessed guys. Let's put this guy... These guys to to guard for now. There's not enough of them. These guys, because they're you know they're flying dudes. They'll just like fly in the back and just get slaughtered. Well, how many hit points they got? Twelve. Eh. Um, bless sermon of courage. You know what? Let's reset this. Let's. I just want you to bless. Or a group of sacred warriors. I thought I could just cast that. Well, I'll watch the battle next. Maybe I should just have these guys fucking attack the rear. <laughs> Since hell. Um, oh, because I have them on this. Since I've uh had no no. <laughs> Got killed by these lizard guys. And they just immediately just stabbed my leader to death. My god to death. These guys should be able to hold out a little bit. We got the obsidian club. We got the furs. Bronze hatchet. All right, let's put these guys in, though, with this guy. Is this going to fuck shit up? That is going to fuck shit up. Hmm. I could. These guys I was using as slingers, but they're, they're kind of suck. So let's put them in here. Nope. It's still no. I don't really want to bring... This guy, I guess I'll bring him. I'll bring him in. And we'll mix these guys into there. They're gonna attack rear. You know what? They're gonna attack rear. So let's put them there. Attack closest, real chumps going in. We got chumps and, you know, I'll put these guys back a little bit. Well, he's blessing. He's gonna attack closest? Why would I wanna do that? I don't want you to attack closest. What do you do? You don't do shit. You're going to stay behind troops. Now, we have an army that could probably take these, these, these guys. Let's have it go in here. I think we could take 20 guys. I mean, I, I know this changes, but Look at there, there's a bunch of undead right there. All right, we need to recruit another king, dude. And what can we recruit here? 
Just some suckers. Do we want to do that? We can get some archers in. Yeah, let's get a couple of archers going over here. What's their precision like? 10. Ooh, morale of 8. Well, right now we're scraping the bottom of the barrel. Call God. We got the turkey research. <laughs> I don't know why the turkey makes me laugh so much, but I'm glad he's there. Uh, 10, 10, 25. I guess I can't hold off my... Oh, here we go. Sure, let's go to here. This spy is slow. And... Oh, that's what I was going to do. That's what I was going to do. Let's look at my research here. Conjuration 1 should let me summon some toads. For two nature gems, and I got nine. How many of those do I get a turn? I think I get, oh, I can just click on this, not that. Um, I get one a turn. But let's let's bring some, here's one. Summon animals, I haven't done that in a long time. I used to do that all the time with Pangea. Um, what is a shadow imp? I think it's a scout. Yeah, it's a commander. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? Once again, because chat has mentioned that I waste. They're like, you know, you could do this, this, and this. And I'm like, oh, I never thought about that. And then you could have an und undead army. So I'm going to pop that dude out. And just, we'll check. He's a commander, so. Uh, call God, call God, call God. We're recruiting everybody. We're ending my turn. So that's the other thing I've been trying not to do is not restart a game at the first setback. All right, bind imp. We got the bind imp. Summon some toads. I don't know. We got some toads. Uh, Emor, that's the undead guy. Hey, reptile brain, the carpenter of the insides. What? Queen of eloquence is risen from the dead. Uh, she lost one of her nat nature magic. Let's try not to get you killed again here. Uh, one crippled guy died. And we took them with 13 losses to their 32. What, why did I watch this? Oh, I want to see how many, what the blessing works like. They're all one group. And what is his name? Um, that's not him. Blood Bond. That's the game. That's the, the game. I just noticed that it was the carpenter of the insides. Um, what was I doing? I was checking to see what his name was. Telok. Okay, he's just going crazy with blessing. Man, those slaves are slow too. Okay, my birds came down. Slaughtered that dude. And that dude. Huh. So are these guys blessed? They are. Oh, those other ones just took off. I assume they're gonna come back down, yeah. All right, did we lose anyone? We lost the ja Jaguar warrior. <coughs> Lizard warriors I don't care about. All right. Victory. Oh man, my treasury sucks. Let's go to five. And where is she? Here she is. She's back in action. You know what I should have given her last time? Oh, do they? I should have given her some of this. I did just send, I just sent her in to die. Um, okay, where's my imp? Oh, he's very small. Dark powers. 
He's just like a stealthy, he can't lead anything. He can't cast any spells. He's just like a stealthy, just like a scout. Oh, he's faster than my other scout, though. Can I recruit a leader over here? No, I need a lab. It's tempting to build over here, too. Because this guy isn't bad. What did I need? A lab and a temple. It's not that tempting. All right. All these guys can get back into action. Right. Well, first, what are we going to do with reptile brain here? Um, even with blood bond, she, she just got slaughtered. <laughs> just slaughtered. 99 hit points. Gone in like five seconds. What can you summon, my lady? You can give some some animals. That's it. That's all you you can't even. We don't even have the gems for that. What spells can you cast? Oh, I don't have anybody researching. Let's fix that real quick. Well, no. Let's figure out what we're gonna do with her. Where are you? Cast a specific spell. All right, so if I stick her, if I fill her up with, with dudes, with uh, blood slaves, she can cast some spells. Blood heal, what does this do? Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's stick her full of, what did I give her, six? Let's give her like 10. Let's give her like 20. And we're gonna we're gonna change that horrible mistake. No, I don't want a specific spell. I just want you to cast spells. And we're gonna have you stake right here. What she need? What is her protection? Is that what got me killed? Is she has like no no man? She just she just got her ass kicked. Her protection is that bad. Probably what we want to give her is, is forge like a magic item or something. Oh, so that will make these guys a, a lot more powerful. Where are they? These guys are a lot more powerful. Um, I don't know what this does. Oh, they got the lance in one hand and the dagger in the other. Gotcha. <clears throat> I did lose one of these guys. So hopefully that... So the issue I have with flying creatures is that they usually... You know, they jump to the back or wherever they jump to. Wherever you tell them to jump to. They jump there and immediately everyone just slaughters them. And I played... I actually like playing those one flying nation where you... You can just pump out a bunch of those guys and like, you know, you can move from here to here and one, your whole army can like jump all over the place. So those guys are pretty fun um, to play. What can we recruit here? Nothing important. But I also failed and, and lost when I played that one. There was, a there was a turning point where I couldn't pump out troops, ground or any troops fast enough to... Um, to do the trick. All right, astral projection, we don't care about that. What about forge magic items? You got like a sword, slave collar. I don't know if you can do that. I can look. Uh, making them less prone to panic. Don't really want to do that. What is this thing? Rabbit foot. <clears throat> Once per month, the luck from the rabbit foot will be able to negate an attack that otherwise have injured its wearer. The attack can be negated even outside of combat, but the attack does not pr protect against attacks that cause instant death. But have we got any, like, what about this thing? Ring mail. Um, what does it cause? Five astral gems? I'm thinking about what I, I can, if I can make something, throw it on my... Because so, I did not, I failed with my thug idea. Probably everyone who was watching was like, what are you doing, you fucking idiot? Um, but that's how I, I got to learn. 
This gives me protection in my head. I'm like, all of these are astral gems. I got 10. She doesn't need weapons. She needs armor. So let's have somebody create this. That's what you will do. You will forge that with your astral action. Oh, wait. We could forge different stuff. Water walking? I don't really want that. Ring of Frost. How about a helmet? What do you got? Shields, helmets? No. You are going to be on the research. Uh, actually, cast ritual. Yeah, we don't need that. You're going to be on the research, JM. Um... That could, that could work. I always have them attack rear and they still get slaughtered. So maybe I'm probably doing something wrong. Who is this guy? Who are you? Oh, you're my new tribal king. Gotcha. You are going to, do you have troops? Yeah, we got enough. We got troops. Hey, there's some, some of these frogs. What is this thing? Poisonous skin. I've never seen that one. It's an animal. It tramples. I like these guys. Poison spit. Range of 11. Yeah, I like these guys. They're going to go in with uh, you, buddy. Where are you? There you are. And you are going to march forth there. And we're, so we're still recruiting here and here. Maybe we should turn that off because we can't. You know what? We can recruit a dude here. No, it's not here. We can recruit a guy here to run around and pick up dudes. Except there aren't enough resources. Well. Alright, what are we doing here? Forge magic item. I think I already checked this. Is this my is this an astral guy as well? I have a lot of astral guys, I think because they were cheaper. Here's a forest guy. Forge magic item. Uh, what is this? I I've done this shield like a bunch of times, but I can't remember what it does. Uh it shield's not as sturdy as a good iron shield, but it's very light and doesn't encumber its user. Oh, that's the issue. Is she's a I'm gonna have her cast in spells. Yeah, we don't want that. What do we got shoes wise? Run with un... Well, we don't really want that either. She'll run straight into combat and be killed. Poison and... What does it cost for this one? Five? So how does that work? I can't remember. With spells, what is the encumbrance deal? Let's go back to this guy. Forge magic item... This adds to encumbrance one, but is that is one high? Uh, it's very burdensome to fight with heavy armor. The encumbrance value be added to the unit's fatigue for each attack in melee combat. But what about for magic? Um, this piece of armor is magic. Magic shields are less likely to break from hard blows, and all types of magic are more resistant to it. Hmm. <clears throat> you know what? We're going to keep her casting spells. Maybe I don't need that. I do want to build a bunch of uh, uh, warriors, though. So, but let's put them on research. Research, research. Because there's nothing. No, wait. What am I thinking here? Yes, research. Research. Forge, yes, we'll keep that. What was I going to have you do? Cast a ritual spell. You can, oh, you can't. Forge magic item. Encumbrance two. Strength through its wear. We're, we are going to do that later. I thought... Now we'll have her research for one turn. 
or we can have her re uh yeah let's do that instead actually we'll have her search for sites i think i thought i was going to do something with her but i can't remember what it was what is my summon the toads i can't do that again oh they're the only one with the I do need him with all right you know we don't really need that as bad it only costs two just how sh safe is she she's probably not that safe we just <laughs> what are we talking about we know she's not that safe she just died uh, oh I can't do it with these guys I'm gonna try to have her guard where is, I think it's you. I'd rather have the brawn, well, what does it do? 20 damage, 11 attack, and two lens. I can't remember what lens does. All right, well, I'd rather have you guys in here. You, well, I guess we'll have both. You three will guard her. And everybody's on research. What does that give us, a 65 a month? Man, this shit's gonna be flying by. Uh, what do we want this to go to after this? Do we have any other special shit going on here? Would be nice to get some more. I don't see any blood stuff there though. Uh, we're doing blood level two. What do we get for that's these beast bats that the the manual I was reading crossbreeding is kind of an interesting one. You get all those weirdos. I like the weirdos. Um, man, though, we're gonna need to start blood hunting like mad, which I never do because it fucks the whole place up. But I picked a I picked this person. I picked my own damage here. Blood two. Conjuring 2 doesn't get a shit. Blood 2 will get us that. Construction. Oh. Let's do construction 2. Yeah. And what am I doing here next? Let's see, there's another one of those. I wonder if it will tell me what... Oh, wait. Let's have him go north. We have another guy on the move over there. And let's look at the statistics. Oh, there's only there's only a couple people on here. I expected this to be full already. Look at that guy. I think it's one of the. I don't know how to pronounce it. Citrus. C T I S guys. All right, enough fucking around. I'm like reluctant to end my turn because it's so, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I've played Pangea like probably 50 times in my life. I've played these guys like once and immediately died. And I don't think I even tried the blood stuff. I just picked them like at random. And that was years ago. But we're going to get there. We're going to blood hunt like mad. Oh, I got to make one of these guys. Hey, we only lost a slave and a warrior, but of course there's that. I guess, is that a bug? I don't know. We took it. Um, oh, I didn't do a blood hunt. My, my uh, domain, dominion went out, or expanded, I mean. We are going to search for magic sites. We are going to get you guys into my army. And you're going to... Attack closest. We'll put you in the front line here. I don't, I don't, why are you at the front actually? Okay. And you know what we can do is we can look at what you're talking about on here. Hold and attack rearmost. 
let's see if that does does what we're thinking here. I'm actually going to put it back here, though. <clears throat> that way, you can come up here. Like you were saying, maybe they'll get into the back of archers or something. Not that jump into the back of a bunch of dudes who just tear them to pieces. So she already picked up that. She's going to search for sites. She already lost one level of blood. No, of, of uh, whatchamacallit, nature. We don't really want her to die again, but I think she's okay there. Research, we got 150 gold, so we're going to hold off on... This is a five. We'll go to ten. We're going to have a huge issue with uh, unrest here soon. Okay, we got him coming. What can we do here? We could have both these guys capture slaves. We're pretty much going to have an unhappy population regardless of what we... we not regardless, but we have to have... It, shit's going to be unhappy. Because I'm capturing slaves where... You know, and I should bump this to 10 just because of that. Yeah, unre un unrest reduction. I hate to m use all of my points here. Or all of my money on this ship, but maybe I'll get lucky and get a... It's just going to... My income's going to suck if I have un unrest all the time. I mean, it's it's it has to happen, though, because I'm going to be blood hunting and... All right, what were you doing here? You were summoning frogs. Let's get some more let's get some more toads let's keep you bringing the toads in your army set up all right you're not quite ready for that i think i was going to have him cruise around we're out of cash all the research done where is this guy here we go he can only go to there and you're going to go out this way actually let's go back this way we'll loop him around here and yeah you're able to stand there says so quiet my music stopped and it's just without the music it's weird without the you know normally there's the the dominions music too research and blood ma magic is complete there we go we got we got our bind blood well oh, that's expensive we can get blood fiends too we get a spine devil Spine devils are are spine devils are spine covered wingless demons that fight with two venomous claws. The spine, I think those are their leaders, aren't they? The spines cover their bodies are poisonous, and anyone attack them with short webs may get poisoned. Or maybe that's a fiend. The caster sacrifices several blood slaves to contact and bind a fiend of darkness. Fiend of darkness, a coal black demon summoned from the abyss. They fight with venomous claws and have bat like wings. Fiends of darkness are able to hide in the night and are stealthy. Hmm. Summons, I can't remember. Bone fiends? Summon bone fiend. To summon and bind several bone fiends. Those are... We know what bone fiends are. Bone fiends are... Uh... No, I don't. I can't remember. Let me look. Dominions five bone fiends. I think they're I don't think they're um bone fiend. They're not leaders. Reigns of dead uh dead devils bound by the laws of death. There's no death with internal lies and with countless eons even devils die. So what happens if if I put search this thing? What was the other one? It was a bone, a spine devil. Does this tell me if it's a leader? Spine devil. 
unit type unit. Okay, so unit type unit must mean it's a unit. And then what was the other one? Fiend. Just a fiend. Find fiend. Fiend. Doesn't tell me though. Field, Fiend of Darkness is what it summons. It just says he's a unit as well. How do I know if he's a commander? I guess I'll just have to cast it and find out. Bone friends? <laughs> Those are different things. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Let me... Do something real quick and so according to the well they all said units I don't know how to distinguish from that wiki if they're units or commanders I would like them to be commanders Let's see what did this one say so this one says commander at the back these are not yeah these are not commanders these are just just dudes I don't know why I got so sidetracked looking at that construction two we will have and one will have in like no problem so ogres ogres are nice Two hundred trying to think like combat spells too, but we don't have all we have is nature personal regeneration. Nature and blood, so I think I'm just gonna go blood three. I think we're gonna just uh jam it in there and just keep going with the blood i never play blood so i need to get to the evil blood shit later summoning demons and stuff army set up what do we got it said some of you guys are dying starving to death or some shit all right we're gonna have to have both you guys I didn't bring any. Oh, I've left him with my god. We're going to have to have you guys kind of split up here because I can't fit everybody in here. Uh, we'll set these guys to the back. We'll uh, attack closest. We'll put you like right here, double line it. <clears throat> attack closest, attack closest. Chumps go forward, second chumps go forward. These guys, you're gonna not be with this group though. But that's gonna fuck that up. There we go. Just a couple of frogs. These guys are gonna attack closest hold and attack rear. Let's put these frogs over here though. They like spit shit in. If you touch them, you get poisoned. All right, where are we going from here? That looks, that looks good last turn. Oh, these guys are not, oh, they're, they're blessed, but they're not, that does not look good. Militia and heavy cab, huh? I can't tell these guys to do anything. No, I can't. Huh. Well, 
I guess we'll head back this direction. I would like to take this out. Is that as far as we can go? Because this one, this is kind of blocked by these these mountains. I kind of fucked myself here. Pick that shit up. I mean, from here. And what we can do here is we can turn off this. We don't need this shit. <clears throat> And we can also turn this off. Actually, no, let's keep these archers. Even though they're shitty, we'll get like one more turn of those guys because I got a, quite a few of them. We can pack them into that other army. This guy, I guess we'll come back. We ran this all the way over here for no reason. Well, maybe next turn one of these will go down. And let's stick all these guys in with you. And we'll have you march to here. We're going to do it. <clears throat> 71, 10, 10. 12, 14, let's do one. Oh, what is this? Who the fuck are you? There's like a gold, gold color here. Is it this guy? Is that what that is? It is. It was this gun. Python. Oh, this, the Machaka guys. So I like playing these guys. Oh, they got these shitty dudes, though. I like playing these guys for the spiders, but they're really hard to to play. At least for me, they are. Um, hmm. I'm already in trouble. Well, I guess I was in trouble on, on turn one when my, uh, oh, we got two dudes right here. Holy shit. You have to be summoning some demons and shit. <clears throat> I mean, that's the whole point. Speaking of which, I was like, doesn't one of these guys have a summon demon specialty? They don't. I guess it's just my lady. <clears throat> My serpent headed lady. Thought one of these did, but I guess not. All right, well. Kind of wasting her over here then. Actually, I don't need to search in my capital. I can just have her searching as she moves. And we'll just keep the unrest out of the capital. Uh, you're moving back there. You are, you found another dude? This is gonna get sketchy. I should go this way. No, that looks like it's a dead end. Nope, it's not a dead end. There's my bone dude, he's moving. All right, I'm gonna take a quick break. I will be back in less than, uh, than, Five minutes if I can click this button. There we go. I'll be back in less than five minutes.
No suitable blood slaves. What the fuck? <laughs> I was just outside thinking, you know what? I need blood slaves like mad because um, I need to summon demons. I need to get out of this hole. This hole that I'm in. Uh, construction is complete. Excellent. Let's view research. We're going for level three. Uh, binding some bats. Let's check out these bats here. Oh, they're those bats. They're blessed. They're sacred, I mean. They don't eat, huh? Well, I'm going to have some flying... Flying stuff going on. So I'm going to put the fly them all in one. What's their morale? Like 13? Yeah, I'm going to stick these all in one. What are you? What are you doing? Oh, that's the commander. That from the... The, th the commander from the thing... Uh, dormant gods are waking. Did not find any things. Yeah, I need to be summoning. Getting there probably wasn't enough population there. There's probably some. Does anyone in chat know what the population you should be blood hunting at? It says there's zero and the rest there. Um, she'll pick up these guys. She'll search. It seems like the waste of a god, but just sitting there and powering her is also a waste, I guess. Which is what I did with my Pangea god has like crazy spells, but she doesn't do anything. She just kicks it. Hey, what happened here? Oh, they were down there. Uh, and I was thinking when I was out smoking, I played a game where... Um, we're going to go in here. Where... Okay, he brought more guys, but we can't carry any more guys. Uh, I was doing great, and then all of a sudden I ran into some computer guys. I can't remember who it was, and I just was getting my ass handed to me. And how I recovered from it was just, I think it was Pangea again, was just summoning just shit tons of stuff. She, he can still carry these. Oh, but they'll take the penalty. Right? Yep. Yep. Get out of here, Toad. You're staying with this army. And so I think I need I need to be summoning. Uh, yeah, actually, let's put these on rear most. Um, I need to be summoning shit constantly is what I need to be doing. All right, their attack closest. They're holding rear attack. We got the suckers at the front. <clears throat> going in I mean I would like to go in here but what I need is some priests and I mean I know I have a shit ton of priests but none of them are in that army I don't want to blood hunt in my capital because my capital is my only f money right now Help spread my do dominion. Oh. Is it like five or six thousand? I should probably wasting my time then doing it there. I mean, the capital would be the spot. Oh, my dominion actually just shrank. Holy shit. Okay, we're going to have to have... Who is the worst at... I think these guys are all 13s. What? You're old already? Uh, we're going to have you perform. I got to give you some slaves, huh? How many do you need? Oh, you're old too? Holy shit. I, I was mentioning this earlier. I'm taking this personally that these people are old. It says max age is 50 for that guy. One of these said 46. Man. All right, these guys are going to be croaking left and right. So, what was I doing? We can... No, I don't have enough. Forge a magic item. I don't think I need any of this stuff. That'd be an interesting one. What does this cost? Five? Nah, let's not waste our time with that. 
I do, I do want to thug out it, dude. Item is restricted and cannot be forged uh, by most other nations. What is it? Jade knife is enchanted with blood magic and used by Michelin priests to increase the effectiveness of their blood sacrifices. Two more blood slaves than usual. Only the priests of certain... Huh. I mean, it seems like I should... I don't have enough blood slaves right now. I could have this guy. No, I got to do that, man. I, I don't even have a dominion in my goddamn capital. <laughs> I don't know how to play these guys. These guys are rough. Oh, did I forget to move this guy? I think I did. I think I didn't forget. I Oh, he's all the way over here. Um... I think I moved him and then didn't move him. We can bring some more toads into play. Let's bring the toads into play. How much money we got? We have enough to find one of these? 230, huh? So I got one of those guys, one of those guys, one of those guys. I think I rather have one of these. And you know what we can do? We got two of these. We got three of these. We'll send one of them to this army. Research is so we I'm not used to research being this easy. <clears throat> Uh, can she preach? No. Makes sense. So I'm not going to have her do a blood hunt unless it's like around five or six thousand. I don't know. I guess if this is a quick game and I lose this this quickly, I'll know not to play these people again. I mean, I know I'll know to start over and do a better job the next time. I was just kicking so much ass with the Pangea one, and I'm gonna go back to that one. Don't worry. I'll probably play that next time. Uh, they've already got that. We got that. That's two of these are marked off. We took them. We lost some slaves and some lizard warriors. Oh, and some warriors. The Eagle Warriors killed 14. Let's take a look at the retreat details. Uh, let's let's check these Eagles, how they did. With our test attack, hold an attack here. Oh, I didn't even, I forgot about the toads there. Oh, they spit, they spit on those, uh, those knights. Let me pause this real quick. Is this poisoning of them? Doesn't seem to be. Oh, so these guys are not going to charge forward. They're just going to spit. That's interesting. I didn't know that. Okay, then these guys just got into the back. I think the hold and attack is the move. Because it gives them a chance to... Oh, are we poisoning our own guys? Jesus Christ. Oh, and what's this guy? Who's this guy? Oh, he turned into some jaguar thing? I didn't know they did that. <laughs> I thought they just... Yeah, so this is the move there. Have him hold for a second. Alright, so the toads don't work the way I thought they did. But that's okay. And then those dudes flew in and finished them off. Hey, plus 10 defense is nice. And what is this? Windy spear, spire. All right, so the front line got pretty decimated, but that's okay. Trying to think, can we combine these guys? I think we can. 
There we go. The toads are over there. Can we like triple line these guys? Like that, maybe. A little wrap around. I don't want them to be close to the toads. The toads are are not good news. <clears throat> yeah, let's have you. I think we can take those guys, no problem. We'll have you search for magic sites. You can pick up all these dudes. And I actually could have her start leading. I could have her go into the front and cast spells and stuff. Having her in combat would probably be beneficial. Uh, we can turn this recruitment off. Okay, I already did. And he is going to meet up there. I didn't give him any blood slaves, which was fucking stupid. Uh, we need to go army set up. Well, let's see what spells he can cast. Yeah, he can cast all sorts of shit, but... Need some blood slaves. Hmm. Blood slaves are going to be the choke point for this. I should have, have looked up for a strategy or something. I like to go on blind so I can look like a fool on the internet. All right, you're going to go back in here. Oh, actually, you're going to go up pick up. What do we got here? We only got a couple of guys. Yeah. You'll go back here. All right, we have 230 gold. We should have a new dude, a guy here. Yep, here he is. We got a significant number of guys. Are these guys magic? Magic beings? They probably are. A demon, I think, counts as magic, right? Well, let's see here. Let's recruit. We're gonna have to have another one of these guys anyways. <clears throat> We sure do have a lot of sacred guys. Yeah, I think I might... Oh, my God. Even with that blood sacrifice? Oh, no. I put her... Did I put him on research? Yeah, I gave him five. Oh, man. I forgot to do the blood sacrifice. Or somehow change it to research on accident. All right. Now I got two of these guys so let's we don't want to capture those slaves what can you do we can do more toads let's bring more toads in uh, you're going to research I do want to forge this but I don't have enough gems not yet so you can research Research, research, research. Blood level three. Conjuration two. And then we're going to do blood. Construction two, we already have. Blood four, yeah, I think we're do every other here. And I don't think how much do these guys cost? Yeah, we'll we'll be able to do that soon. Yeah, man, man have a good night. I'm gonna sign off here in a little bit myself. I don't know, twenty, thirty minutes. Who knows? It's one of the you know, it's one of those games. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time. All right, what am I doing here? Back in here, yep, we can go to there, and then we hopefully will have choices. I don't want to get too close to these guys, but I guess it doesn't really matter.
we can put a little bit of this into here. Want 10 at least in all my spots. Lower the, the the um what you call it lower the unrest all right i think that's everybody he's going to stand there and that's actually a good spot it's neutral let's keep going this direction yep in turn It's like a completely different game than Pangea. Pangea, you know, I just get the shit going. And this one, I got to be, well, I did have this setback. Even if the god hadn't died, though, I only brought her back. It only took like three turns to get her back. Um, we got that. You found nothing. Crippled the guy died, and there was a va uh, battle, and we only lost one. So that was beneficial. That was very good. That was a good turn. I would have liked to have found, okay, so that that popped that out here. And I don't have the, no, it's a, it's just, they're all one, I gotcha. And how many of his, he killed two of them. So we'll leave him on sacrifice. I wasn't sure how many she would, he, they would sacrifice each turn. All right, here's this guy. We don't want to fight him yet. He's got a bunch of spiders there. Heavy inch infantry and slingers. Why are these guys gr or golden colored? I gotta change my music. Uh, sometimes it goes to like a new album and it's like a, the live album and I don't know. I'm not into live albums that much. It's like every song but shittier um see these guys are gold too and these guys i wonder what that means all right we're not going to waste our time this one has five thousand but it's also right next to this new enemy we'll keep, we'll go in here what have we got in our army bunch of sucks These guys, oh, this is what's going on here. This is not who I think this is. <clears throat> She's got spells and guarding. Bring this guy into here. Yeah, you can't. You can't carry that. It's a bummer because I sent that dude away. Where is that guy? He's with the army now. We'll need another runner. How much? I got three. Let's see. What do we got researching here? We got one water, one astral, one nature. One astral, one nature, and one turkey. <laughs> uh, your leadership sucks, turkey. But you know what? What is your research? 13? Your research isn't bad for... And you got three nature. One of his map movements, 22... 22. What happens if if I put you with you? Oh, these guys are undead. Who? Who can lead undead? Just you guys, huh? Hmm. Put him with the new guy. 
And if that's the case, can we stick all this other shit in with the new guy? We can. New guy is off to the, the races here. Yeah, I need to sweep back this way. No matter what I do, I have to sweep back this way. I mean, I guess I could go down. Oh, I can't. I would have to go back this way, but I got to go through here. So, is it worth it? I don't have any chumps, so what I can do... Can I have these guys capture slaves? Just everybody? He doesn't. Whoops. What can you do? Search for magic sites. Perfect. And we'll try to depopulate this place to keep going forward. <clears throat> and then we'll do a blood hunt here. I think you're supposed to blood hunt your capital just only every once in a while. I think if you put, if I had put like growth into my do, do, uh, dominion instead of just leaving it blank, I think you could like set growth. I can't remember, but you can set it away that it, it's not as, as detrimental as you, as you think. All right. What do we got left here? Who are you? This guy's name is Quetzalcoatl. Um, he's just going to stand there like an idiot. Who are you? Oh, you're another tribal king. All right, we got two of them. I actually still like that spot. Oh. Man, if we could do something with fire gems. Do I have anybody who does fire? No, and these guys get so old so fast. Oh, these guys, these turkeys turn into, uh, now we should give you some fire, 50. All right, you're not doing that yet, turkey. Oh, this was a mistake. You know, the, the guys with the glamour abilities, those guys are too fucking tough. There. That ability is... That is like the end. So that Van Heem is... Whenever we see them, a lot of times when we're doing multiplayer, it's just over. I don't know if they nerfed them in 5 or what. 4 it used to just be over. They would have like four dudes, and the four dudes could just uh, wreck everything. All right, we don't get that many of these guys when we do a, a slave hunt or whatever it's called. Hmm. Let's put. No. Whoops. One, no. Let's put one, two, three of you guys in with this group. And then we'll put these three here. And we're gonna go, we're gonna go in here. This could be a disaster, but we can't be waiting around for, oh, some, wait, how'd I get so much gold? Did I not do anything last turn? Did I not recruit anything, buddy? I should have recruited you. Oh, maybe I didn't recruit one of these guys. I don't think I did. Uh, what do I need? At the home base, we have one, two. Either or. Let's do a water one. I guess I could do these guys are cheaper and they don't they live a hell of a lot longer. Yeah, let's do one of those guys. This turkey dude can live forever. 
He's not good at anything else, but he's like my researcher. I'm a blood hunter. Oh, she didn't do her search yet. He's in good spot. No, he's still he's not in a good spot. We're gonna find the edge of that guy. You can defend, you can defend, you are not defending. You are gonna move here. Make sure there's nobody hanging out. So if she blood hunts, I'm pretty sure the slaves will appear in her inventory and she just needs to drop them off if she wants, but she might carry around those guys. I can't believe that there's all these people who make content for Dominions. Like, how big is the Dominions community? It must be huge, much huger than I think. I always think that if there's only like six people who play, but I mean, there's been three people in chat today. Um, so there, I mean, there's a number of reptile brain. She found a wood oak. Excellent. Um, there's a number of people who play this. I just, it's weird. Uh, battle. All right, we lost 17. That wasn't bad. I thought this would be... So what's up with these these guys? Oh, they're bronze dudes. Gotcha. Gotcha. I think I already set up my research. Yeah. So it's blood level 3. Frost demon. Or Frost Fiend. I want some interesting commanders. The caster casts a spell with infernal symbols dragging the blood of virgins. Blood rituals cast from the circle will have their range increased. That's nice. Um, I mean that in a good way. We're almost up to Jaguar Fiends. Okay. Oh! These guys have... We have... And we're running into the the surrounding areas. It's okay. Don't panic. Don't freak out yet. All right. Wasn't I gonna look about? Oh, the turkey guy was already done. Man, that turn went fast. Where's my new turkey guy? Is that this guy? Yep. Turn into a turkey so I can. Um, so I can tell which one's which. All right, we got one of these, one of these. Let's do another water one like I was going to do last time. I think it's the moon. No, it's... And we got these up to 10. We're going to follow my other rule of like kind of bumping these up when uh <clears throat> when i'm adjacent to a bad place which is going to really eat into my gold this is kind of a little little army that can join Huh. I could have this group co uh, collect slaves and or or and or and search <clears throat> Or just move into this. There's 60. Uh, 
This is a nice little army, but I don't want it to, uh, I want to get organized with this other group. And so that's going to be one, two, three. That's like a long, long time. You know what we could do instead? This is what we'll do. You're going to go join up there. You're going to go in here. Is this guy still sacrificing? He is, and he's down to, to uh, two. So let's add a couple more. That's a quaddle here is a leader. I don't think we need any. Oh no, we got enough to move it. some troops forward. And bringing some more of these guys. What does this do? The casters learn their recuperative secrets of cannibalism. In a gruesome ritual lasting a month, he consumes the blood and feasts of ritual purified sacri uh, sacrifices. The blood feast requires copious amounts of flesh and blood of unpurified victims as well. So the populace in the province where the caster resides is slaughtered in great qualities. The flesh and blood of the victims rejuvenate the caster, healing him of all or at least most afflictions. Blood mages who partake too often in blood feasts often develop uncontrolled craving for human flesh. The ritual does not work on inanimate uh, beings. Removes up to 10 affliction, kills up to 750. It doesn't make him younger, though. I would do it if it made him younger. I wouldn't do it in this one. Uh... It does not make you younger. So the the bats, I guess we'll do another turn of research. And we don't, oh, we already did that. And if you, got, you guys are moving forward, she is waiting here. So let's see. Oh, oh, I can, oh, I can make some horse archers. <clears throat> I should have done this the turn before. My armies are going to be f a fucking mess of just different types of dudes. Just a mess of different types of dudes. I guess that's fine. Bronze guys, bronze heavies, and then slingers, huh? We need to have more troops up around this northern front here. Man, it's already been like 25 minutes or something since I said, or no, 15 minutes since I said I wasn't going to play for that much longer. Uh, what are you doing? You are just hanging out for now. Keep checking this area out a little bit. All right, intern. I wanted, want only one battle. That's all I want to see is one battle in my my events thing. If I see more than one, then it's bad news. And we don't want to pick a war with anyone. All right, there was one battle, and it looks like we took it. Hey, we got nine blood, blood slaves out of there. They're uh, very upset. We lost, oh, three eagle warriors. Let's view how this... These are just like barbarians of Ulm and shit.
Where are they gonna pop in? Maybe they couldn't fly back far enough? Come on, buddies. Show up. Oh, they didn't fly back far enough. Oh, and then our own archers and shit fucked them up. And happens. Uh, unexpected event. Growth plus one. Domain change. Turmoil. Oh, there's another battle. We defeated him. We lost a lizard warrior and a couple of slaves. What was this about? This is a pretty interesting one. The governor of the province has died from a wasting disease. His incompetent brother-in-law has now taken over their administrative duties. Where are these guys coming? Guess they just showed up. We survived, though. Wow, it's weird how the Dominion fluctuates. And none of this is above one. I don't know how that if that works that way. Like how it works with the blood sacrifices. <clears throat> Do we wait a turn? Or... Oh, wait, I'm not recruiting guys here, am I? Good. They're not on, the, not on the way. I mean, they might be on the way a little bit. Army set up. Here we go. All right. She gives a plus two morale. She can have up to four. If I put this in here, that just makes them undisciplined, though. I'm just going to stick them in there for now. Uh, Frontline chumps. Can we dual line these guys? Nah, box is fine. She can definitely have magic dudes. Oh, not all. Sorry. I'm apologizing to no one there. I don't know. Oh, you can't have them up there because it's they're on guard duty. Hmm, how should we do this? We don't need him on guard duty anymore. She's got some serpents that comes with her. I think this guy just got uh, bushwhacked. No, I don't know what what it's called. Gang, gang, um, gang planked. I can't remember what it is. It's when sailors, when you... shanghai That's what it's called. Uh, that guy just got shanghai into this army. That was not the original plan, but... Can I put this in the same group? I can. We need him to carry these... Deal with these frogs. Who is this guy? Oh, he was on the way there anyways. I forgot. He was I thought he was just a commander running things, but if he can carry the We got well, this is good. Uh attack closest. And who is this group? Alright, they're actually gonna stay right here, then they'll teleport to the back. Uh, they're in attack closest. They're going to fire their bows. They're going to hold an attack rear. They're going to attack closest. You're going to just be the frog. You're just going to be frogs. You're going to act like frogs. We got some blood hunting. She's now carrying around a nice chunk of dudes. These people are pissed, but now we lost the, the dominion there. We'll carry on. What do we got? Let these guys recover. I actually didn't. That didn't do as much damage as I thought it would. 
to their population. All right, buddies, what are you guys up to? Can you move to here? No. No, you can. You could you could not go to that guy. Let's do that. We got another dude sitting idle, so let's put whatever army we have and move him out. I guess let's turn off recruitment here. We'll have him pick it up, but the, the route will be from here. Wow, we can't even build one dude there to here. Do here. No point in recruiting those guys. Bronze guys won't be as good as the rest, but <clears throat> it's something. All right, we are still getting whittled down here, but I think we can take these bronze dudes here. What did we do last turn? We fought there. All right, continuing moving forward. Holy shit. Look at that. They're still expanding right over towards us. We got eight of those guys. Frost Fiend. Oh, that still cost eight. Back on the research. Well, maybe you can forge a magic item or something. Red Coral is commonly used to enchant items to protect against the bleeding caused by battle wounds, but it can just as easily be enchanted to cause bleeding. The Coral Sword is a tooth. Uh, it draws blood and very hard to stop. Wasn't I going to thug out some guys? I didn't even do it. I don't have the leaders for that. I'm going to have to do that with a different group at some point. I don't know how many years of... Um, Uh, I don't know how many years of Dominion playing. I, yeah, I'm gonna, at this point, I've said I'm, I'm playing this one, I'm the other one, and then there's gonna be another one, and another one. Ryla, I still want to play. I should have just played Ryla. I'll play Ryla, or however you pronounce them. All right, we got the researching going. How much are we in? Seven, 77 a month. That will give us the conjuring two. No problem, then we'll be at blood f hidden on blood four. Man, that's expensive for the jaguar f fiends. Research, research, research. We got to recruit here, though. I think we should recruit another one of these turkey guys. And it looks to me... We've expanded a little bit there. Yep, keep going forward. I can't, I hope these guys are fighting a war with each other. You know, I haven't looked at anybody in my Hall of Fame. Uh, what is my color? None of these guys. I would have noticed by now. Um, there was something I just thought of and then immediately forgot. God damn it. Oh, well. In turn. Oh, I was going to check my defense levels. That's what I was going to do. <clears throat> Shields are very useful when attacking archers. Yes, I can imagine. All right, I think I got one more turn. Yeah, I got one more turn in me for tonight. Next time I'll do Pangea, and then the time after that I'll go back to this one and I'll switch, unless I decide to start another new one. In YouTube, I'm breaking down my playlist too. I'll put this, I'll export it to YouTube and we'll have the one, this is one's definitely, everyone can laugh at me. Um, claim the throne. 
Old Forest. We won, but we lost an Eagle Warrior and a couple of other uh, jokers. Hey, this guy became famous. Let's see what his famous ability is. Don't be fat. Iron Will. Good. I mean, I don't care if he's fat, but it's not a very useful thing for my guys. All right. And he's still sacrificing, right? He is. I need to do something about that. We need to replenish this army here. What does this place look like? 4,000. Why we can't go there? Oh, I know why. Uh, let's let's keep them moving here. I was gonna have their her continue like behind the army, but I actually think I'm gonna put her in with the army. We're gonna have her lead this army. I never do that. Like I keep saying, I never do that with any of these gods. So. Oh, you got one guy in here. Great, good job. All right, so following my rule here, can we get these guys to 15? Anything that's adjacent, oh, this is adjacent to it. Bad guy should be at 15. I mean, I'd like to way up to like 45, but that's a different that's a different game. I right, we get a lava lake here. That's pretty nice. Have this guy continue this way. These guys are pretty fucked up. Let's throw some bronze dudes in. Yeah, bear tribe. Don't want any of those. We will capture slaves. Whoops. Capture slaves. And no, capture slaves. No, no, what am I doing wrong here? Defend, there we go, no, no. I just want this one guy to select it. Here we go, search for magical sites. What am I doing wrong is I'm clicking the wrong thing. Uh, Turkey man, change shape and begin your research. Well, actually, what what can you, we only got 12 of those. What do we need to be able to pump out is some fire. This guy's experience, what was it gonna take to empower him to fire? 50? That would be, it'd be nice to well, we won't have any fire gems then, but. Fire gems are the best thing we're getting. Um, Let's stay there. Wait, oh, that's it. Okay, maybe I can get one more turn in here. Man, it is. Well, it's tough without the money. The expansion money. When you start out in, in some of the other nations, you can expand so quickly. I guess I set myself back a little bit there. I should have waited one turn, put a better army in, not put her at the front, whatever. But the expansion... Um, money we need would, would have been nice. Damn, these guys are uh, claiming thrones left and right. 
Oh, well, there's some money. There is some money. Fourteen isn't bad. She can she's gonna be in the shit soon. <clears throat> But every turn that we sit idle, this is what we're going to do. We're not going to sit fucking idle here. We're going to go in here. And... We're going to fill up this front line. Put that lizard up there just because. Just because. All right, this is set up, set up, set up, set up. Going this way, we'll join up our armies and then we'll continue down here. And we will finish off this group. And then we can march back up. At that point, when we get to here. Maybe I can sneak in one more turn before it. So I try to do the turn before an ad comes out. I know I've talked about this a bunch of times. But the idea being that I don't make you guys watch an ad. Because I hate ads, so it's good for the goose. It's good for the turkey, the, the gander. Um, all right, who, who do I need? I got two water guys. Two astral guys. And a nature guy. And let's go through this again. Let's like bump this to like 20. That was a nice windfall of money. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to do 20 across the board though. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Yep. And then, how are you doing? You still got two guys, so. Two, uh. Alright, let's turn off all this recruitment here. There's no point to this. We're not even going in this direction right now. There we go. Sno snooze that ad. I guess this guy will be going through here. Except it's no point in doing that. And this guy bring much smaller army. It's not even point there's no point in him running back up there. Sorry, I'm gonna leave that up. I like those horse archers. At one time I had a bunch of those guys and it was they were quite powerful. Even if the enemy closed in. Okay. That's not the best news there. That's fine news. Make a profit of the stealthy commander in order to get a stealthy preacher. I've never done that. That should be an interest. That'd be an interesting. You can move them into enemy lands, and preach, and cause your dominion to expand or cause theirs to lower. And that would be an interesting. You got to think this game is so has so many different options. It's like RimWorld. You know, RimWorld like people are like eating people and whatnot. That's like the options are built in. And so there's like a ton of options built in this. We lost one. One of these guys? Those guys are expensive. What did we fight? Why were these guys put up such a fucking fight?
Did like our archers shoot our own guys or something? Speed this up a little bit here. I guess there was a lot of heavies. I think ours are frogs and. Oh, uh, they had some good leaders. Or not good leaders, they had some leaders. Well, how can we do this frog thing so it's better? Okay. Uber one. The th throne of pestilence is spreading disease throughout the world. What the fuck? What the fuck, man? Oh, what do we got here? Where's our... Just pick those guys up and keep moving here. I mean, I guess these guys are gonna they're gonna die. I can't have them, you know. There's nothing I can do about that. They are gonna die sometimes. <clears throat> But in the meantime, I, I really don't know what to do with these toads. Let's rearrange everybody here. She can carry 145, so. And they get a bonus to morale. Let's make these double line. Uh, this big mass of dudes. All right, I don't think these need to be a big mass of guys here. We can drop these guys in here as they're... Did you see how slow they moved? They like barely crept forward in that one battle. They're nearly useless. So maybe we should do this instead. Just dump them in here. I think they... they Ooh, a nine. I think they uh, debuff the other guys, though. Hold an attack rear. Undisciplined, you're on the right-hand side. We got, we can put... Guess we're going box there. Why? Because I don't. I want to keep away from those frogs again. I think the frogs might be a mistake. <coughs> All right, these hundred and five will charge forward, attacking closest. They're just a mix mishmash of dudes. These guys are gonna shoot arrows. These guys are gonna stay in the back here. Well, not like stay in the back. They're gonna attack forward. These are my blessed guys. <clears throat> sacred guys. All these guys are sacred. <clears throat> I can't control those guys, so there isn't much I can do there. All right. Now, for this army. We attacked in here. We are not going to declare war on this guy or this guy. We're going to bump this to 15. So, in order not to... We're going to go into here is where we're going to go. We have one, and I brought priests with me. Ah, shit. Oh, no. I thought I brought the wrong... Is it necessary for this other guy to be in this army? It says he has troops. Oh, he has the frogs. Um, He doesn't need to be carrying this. You can be carrying this. And we can head you back. Oh. It'll be faster if he just comes with, if they all just come with me. No, he's going through. He's not. Pretty sure. 
Maybe I'll do like an ohm one one day. <laughs> Talking about so many different. Uh, let's recruit another turkey over here. What do we got? We could bring out more beast bats. <coughs> We're not doing toads anymore. I think they're hurting my own guys. We could do bowl of blood, but man, that's expensive. Let's do one. Yeah. Uh, he's still got the. He's. Is there a reason why his sacrifices aren't happening? Oh, I think it's by the level. So he has a two, so he causes two. But he's probably not sacrificing because he can't uh, cause more. Oh, and he's old. Let's put five. Let's dumb up uh, six. He probably can't expand the domain anymore from his. Are the is there another cheaper? Here we go. Here's a cheap ass priest. It's only twenty seven too. We should actually pump out a cheap cheap ass priest because we're gonna have the priest go build temples. Except the priest, I don't know if we'll have the money. We don't have the money for that. This would be the spot to do it. Well, we'll be getting there soon enough. Um, research, research, cast bowl of blood, and there's nothing we can forge that we want to do. Not that I saw. And the ritual spells, we could do that, but no, let's save that for now. We'll put him back on sacrifice. I'm assuming you need to, a temple to sacrifice. Let's do a double check of my... Well, let's look at Hall of Fame. Where's my dude? Here he is. Uh, make sure I got defense on everybody. Yep. We're going to build that priest just because he's cheap. Yeah, everything's fine. And magic treasure, magical resources. We're still only getting three of those. Wow. There's only 300 people there. Uh, some of these people haven't moved. I just snooze that stupid ad again. If you see that, see that suddenly the map's out of control, it's because, uh, I've alt tabbed onto the other screen. Uh, gins, who the fuck are these guys? Oh, oh, wow. These might be some interesting dudes to play as well. Um,. Do we want him to stay here? Doesn't look like he's necessary to be there, but yeah, let's try to like find his capital. What are you doing? You're picking up guys. You're also picking up guys. I don't want to set up his army. Can I just make this, this cluster fuck at the back? Yeah, we'll set him up afterwards. All right, so that is it for me for tonight. Uh, next time I do Dominions, I'll probably continue with Pangea, then I'll jump back to this one like I managed, keep mentioning, and who knows, maybe I'll start another one. I think I should probably stick to these two until I finish Pangea, because Pangea, I feel like I'm right on the, the cusp of it's going to be a power roll through the rest of the, the map. Maybe I'm wrong. I do have some water people next to me that look like they're getting interested in fighting. And I, they may have uh, taken all of the ocean areas. I don't know. So we'll check that out next time, or I will check that out. We all will check that out, and then we'll come back to this one. I, I'm i surprised that it, with losing my god, I got him back so quick. It wasn't that big of a deal, though I would prefer not to have done it that way if I knew how to play this. But I'm definitely...